funky ass bass line. <laughs> Hey guys, TGS Cinema Gaming here today. Um, it's like seven o'clock in the morning. I was gonna make this video uh, tonight, but I got it all set up last night, so I thought I'd do it now. Right then. So today I'm gonna be showing you how to install Terraria mod. It's an in-game mod, uh, so you can like, yeah, basically use it whilst in-game, which I think is pretty cool. You don't have to do the whole bloody Minecraft invedit thing because that was just hissing annoying. Um, yeah, so yeah, basically. Mm. So first of all, you're gonna want these three files. Well, you only need the top two, uh, but if you haven't got WinRAR, the actual archiver to extract the file, uh, you want to get this. So first of all, you're gonna want to download these two files. Minecraft modding numbers for inventory mod and terraria mod dot raw file download. Now these both lead to mega upload. I upload I uploaded them myself so I can ensure you there is no viruses in there. As you can see here's the Minecraft modding numbers. You wanna click regular download. Close the pop up. You just wanna save the file. And then you just wanna click X. And you're going to do the same for here. Terraria mod.rod. Now, this is the actual mod itself. You're going to click regular download. Uh, yeah, you just want to click save file. Right then, so you can close this. And, um, yeah, basically, you can close all of this. But if you haven't got WinRAR, as I said, do download it, otherwise, you won't be able to do this. Um, yeah, you won't be able to actually do the. Uh, mod for Terraria <coughs> so yeah so after that you can just close your browser and yeah so if I go into my downloads now probably loads of crap in there oh no there's not you don't even need that in there yes. right so here you go if your download clean is uh, downloads page is clean and there isn't loads of crap on it like mine. You should only have two files: Minecraft modding numbers for inventory mod, and Terraria mod. Now we'll have a quick look at this. Um, yeah, I basically all the numbers for all the different items. Now it took me forever to make this, absolutely ages. So please do show some appreciation and subscribe, comment, like, do whatever you got to do. But as you can see, the list just goes on and on and on and on and on. I think it stops at 321. No, 326. So here we go. Yeah. And um, yeah, it, yeah. As I said, there, it took me at least two hours. So please do subscribe, because that would just be great. <laughs> right. So now that you downloaded all the files, you want to click on the Terraria mod, and it should just open in WinRAR. Just close that. You want to click Extract to desktop and we'll click OK. Now that's instructed we can just click off that. Um, it might be easier as well if you copy the list over to your desktop as well. And so here you go. You have Terraria mod and Minecraft modding numbers from in inventory mod. Now what you want to do is you want to open up Terraria mod and as you can see you've got Souls, a readme, and a terraria mod. There's nothing too interesting in the source, just you know, properties, blah blah blah, all that crap. Uh so yeah, you actually have the terraria mod rubber here. Now you wanna click you just wanna like open up a new folder file thing. There we go. Blah, blah, blah. Um documents and you wanna find where you placed your terraria. As you can see, I placed my terraria in my documents. So if I open this folder, yeah, if I open this folder, should have content change log, surface config, start server, Steam uh, API, terraria, terraria server, and install, and uninstall. So you know, once you've got all that, then you want to go back into terraria mod folder, 
and you want to just drag your Terraria mod folder into your Terraria folder as so. Um, now, as you can see, um, yeah, you can obviously see us in there. If we go back to the Terraria mod, it's not in there. So we can just close the Terraria mod folder. Now, you want to open up the Terraria mod like you would Terraria, but not actually Terraria itself, just the mod. So you want to open that. Wait for it to load. And as you can see, instantly this little box comes up. Now, this does work online as well, but if you're not the host and you use this, you'll get like the cheat ban thing and then you'll get kicked but you will be banned for it so you just want to put that by there yeah, and as you can see I've got my two area here not too great but it'll be <laughs> yeah but there were so many items last night on that terraria unbelievable so now you wanna Open that. Now's a good time to actually get the um, Minecraft modding numbers that I was on about. There you go. Nearly fits perfect in. But you want to use this. It's really helpful because it shows you all the uh, stuff and yeah. It is really helpful. Right then, so now you just want to go on Terraria to click single player. Wait for it to load. Um, <clears throat> as you can see, I got my guy, and then I got this yob, ob, ob, yob. Do it. I don't know. I'm just gonna delete him. Uh, yep. Yeah. The character. Uh, and then, oh, you know, I'm just gonna mess about this later. Modding character. There we go. Accept. Go in here. And as you can see, I got my world, which is legit, and then I got world, whatever the hell that says. So, I'm gonna open this as you normally would, and just wait for it to uh, open. And if you use the arrow keys, you can quite freely move. There's nothing wrong with that. Um, yeah. So now you want to click on your Terraria box by here. You want to click Read Players, and there we go. As you can, uh, it's got modern character, which is me, obviously. So I'm going to click on modern character. I'm going to have a look down here. First of all, I'm going to make him like really like lots of health, so that would be 29. So. I'm gonna give him item 29 and I'm gonna click give item and I think I'll give him 10. 15. So now I'm gonna click on here. I click 4. And if you're watching this, as you can see, dead on. There we go. So I got 200 health now. Is it 400 health? Here we go. So I'm practically invin invincible. Now. I'm gonna look for some. There's just loads of stuff. Like you, you wouldn't believe how, how much stuff there was. It. I found um a whoopee cushion. That was like 200, I think. I don't know, but the handgun, ball of hurt, blue moon, half of this stuff. I don't even know what it is. Flipper, breathing reed. You know, there was just loads and absolutely loads of stuff. Unbelievable. Well, there you go. I hope this uh, video helped you. Um, yeah, I hope this video helped. If it did, please comment, rate, and subscribe because that'd just be awesome. I'd be like, woo! <laughs> No I would, I'd be really happy if you did subscribe. Cause then I could upload more videos. I think my next video I'll upload will be a um how to use the map thing. There's a map creator you can use to make all the ground flat. Um I'm gonna be showing you a tutorial on how to use that. 
Um, yeah. Well, thanks for watching. Oh, there's a fishy. Say goodbye, Mr. Fish. Bye. As always, please comment, rate, and subscribe. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye.